Hi loves, welcome back to my channel. In today's video I am reviewing my January Ipsy bag and it is this beautiful bag right here. I love the bag as soon as I saw people starting to post it like on YouTube or on Facebook and Instagram and I just love this sleek look. I love the color of it. I love that metallic finish it has. Um, just an overall cute bag that I know I'm going to keep. I will be trying on the products that came in my bag and I'll be showing you in my video. So stick around. Let's just jump right into it. And the first thing I see here is this hand moisturizer. This one is by 417. Mm, smells like soap. <laughs> um, but let's see how it feels here. It feels really, really smooth. Um, I actually really like it. I don't usually like getting moisturizers or um, at least hand moisturizers or hand lotions in my Ipsy bag um, because I feel like I have so many from um, Victoria's Secret or Bath and Body Works, but this one here is really, really thick. I feel like it's going to be very nourishing on the hands. Um, I really like it. It just smells like soap, but that's okay because I think the smell should fade away. Um, but yeah. I really like and it. And that was the hand moisturizer. The next thing came in a box, but I took it out of the box because I used it today. And it is the Ciate London Geology Top Coat. And it is in this metallic silver uh, little container here. And pretty much it's a top coat that I use today with uh, Kathleen Light's KL Polish in Caramelo. And I use that together on my nails and I absolutely love it. I've gotten nail polishes from that brand before. I'm not saying, I'm not sure if I'm saying that correctly, if it's Ciate or a different way, but I actually really like their nail polishes. I feel like the finish on them is sort of like a no-chip nail polish. Very glossy and very, very smooth on the nail. I also did put um, on just the accent nail this uh, OPI glitter polish in Pop That Cork. So, I really like how it came out and I had been dying to try on the uh, Caramelo shade from KL Polish and I love how it came out. Okay, so next thing is this um, Bahama Mama bronzer by The Balm Cosmetics. It is so cute. It looks like a little book when you open it and it is a bronzer. Um, so yeah, the actual little size of it is not that, you know, convenient for um, a big brush, but I definitely want to try it out and see how I like it. It does look like a darker bronzer, and for me, I'm very, very fair toned, as you can see. Um, so let's see how it comes out. It is so hard to dip my brush in this little, little square, but I'm trying my best um, to get as much product as I can. Alright, so that is with the bronzer on. I like it, but it's, you know, pretty hard to get it out of this little box here, little book here. Um, but I do like the color. Like I mentioned before, it kind of reminds me of um, Benefit's Hula Bronzer. And I really like that bronzer a lot. So, yeah, this is, again, Bahama Mama by The Balm Cosmetics. Next thing is this blush by Manicadar Beauty, and it is called the Paradise Blush. And it kind of is like this coral pinky color, and I'm obsessed with wearing, like, pinks, corals, peaches, um, especially because I am so fair. I just feel like those colors really complement my skin tone. And so, yeah, let's try this one out. Oh yeah, I really, really like that. I'm just going to blend it out. I really, really like that color. I just feel like it's very, very pretty. It's a pretty corally, pinky color. So I really like how it came out. I have never heard of this brand before, but... Um, I'm definitely a fan of this Paradise Blush. And now the last thing in my Ipsy bag is this Trust Fun Beauty Lip Gloss in the shade A Method to the Madness. I've gotten mostly nail polishes from this brand um, in Ipsy and I had first heard of it through Ipsy. And I'm really, really happy that they are continuing to send me this brand because I am absolutely in love with it. Um, but yeah, this looks like another corally pinky color. 
Um, I think this bag is more inspired by maybe spring that's upcoming. Um, but yeah, let's see how this is. I feel like this would be a good lip gloss to put on top of like uh, lipstick and just to add a little, you know, a little bit of shine. So yeah, I really like that. And now let me just spray myself with a little bit of setting spray. So yeah, this is the complete look. That is including everything I got in my Ipsy bag. Um, so far, overall, I really, really like this bag. Um, it came with, you know, nail polish, lip gloss, blush, bronzer, hand cream, and um, I think it was a really nice, complete bag. And the colors that came in the blush and in the lip gloss, I really, really loved. I love corally colors, so I'm definitely going to go online, review my bag, and give it a positive review for this month. Overall, I was a big fan of this month's bag. It looks very sleek, something that I am definitely going to keep, and I love the color and that metallic look that it has to it. So yeah, I would love for you all to subscribe to my channel, hit that like button, and if you are not subscribed to Ipsy, I have my link down below in the description box for you. And thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!